A couple minutes, just stroll down memory lane with you, with the uh, with the sirens going on in the background there in New York. There's a very New York oh, yeah. moment about what I'm about to ask about a uh, a prospect out of Queensbridge, New York, back in the day, Fran. We've had him on the show as Meta World Peace. Yeah. You were you were the one who recruited Ron Artest. What was he like back then? Well, let's- Friend. Let's put it this way. In fact, I think they're coming to get Ron right now. <laughs> <laughs> Is he driving another Lamborghini down the street? Another another F one down the down the street right oh, now? Is that what he's doing? Let me tell you. Oh no, it's possible. I'm looking outside. If no, I think it's not Ron. No, it, it might be Lamar Odom. Wait a minute. Oh boy. Um, oh. But uh, no, but I, I got to tell you, people say, "How did you coach Ron in college?" And I said, "It's very simple. I had to be crazier than him." So whenever I saw him in practice start to bubble up and start to lose the temper, Mm -hmm. I went into full Fran Frischella crazy mode, and I went crazy on the entire team. And this way, he calmed down, and he would come over to me and say, Cody, relax, everything's okay. So when I would see the temper come out, I would actually get crazier than him. And uh, it ended up having – we ended up having a great relationship, and – He's one of my favorite people, and you guys have gotten to know him out there. Yeah. Um, heart, heart as big as gold, most competitive guy I've ever coached on the court, off the court, he would give you the shirt off his back. Are you aware he's become friends with the guy who threw the beer at him in Auburn Hills in the Palace? Are you friends that, he, did, you know that he's contacted him, he knows who he is, he's had conversations? Are you aware of that, friend? No, no, but it's no surprise. He, he's one of the gentlest, kindest guys. You guys remember about 10 years ago, he was the NBA citizen the Walter Kennedy citizen of the year because of what he did in Africa. So um, he's a fabulous guy and I'm, I'm really proud of him because I've known him since he was 15 years old and uh, got a chance to coach him and got a chance to set him on his way. And someone told me, Rich, I'll leave you with this. They Mm -hmm. said, uh, what do you think of Phil Jackson? Someone asked him, he said, great coach, great coach. And then someone said, what about coach Fran? He goes, the coach. The coach. <laughs> well, I'm so. glad for the purpose of this conversation, if there are more than one Fran for Shillas, I'm glad I got the Fran World Peace version. I'm glad I got there that you one. Go. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.